signify by saying nay. The, uh, the ayes have it. The bill is approved and ordered reported favorably to the House. Uh, with that, we'd move on to H.R. 1984, the Disaster Act, uh, our second item of, of the day. I now call up H.R. 1984, asking unanimous consent to discharge subcommittee on economic development, public buildings, emergency management from further consideration of H.R. 1984, and that it be considered as read and open to amendment at any point, without objection, so ordered. Uh, I, uh, I, I strongly uh, I support H.R. 1984, disclosing aid spent to ensure relief for a disaster act introduced by Congressman Peters of California, Congressman Meadows of North Carolina. In 2018 alone, there were 14 natural disasters, result, each resulted in more than $1 billion of losses. While insurance partially covers the cost of disaster recovery, the federal government, along with state, local, tribal, territorial partners, spending billions of dollars annually to respond to recover from these events across more than three dozen departments and agencies. Unfortunately, clear and consolidated information regarding federal spending on disasters is unavailable. The Disaster Act would change that and require the Office of Management Budget to annually compile, publicly release a report on disaster-related spending across the entire federal government. I urge members of the community to support this common-sense measure that will shed more light on how limited taxpayer resources are being spent. Doing so will help better inform how we prioritize our priorities and spending to drive down disaster-related expenditures in the future. I now recognize uh, Subcommittee uh, Chair uh, Titus to explain the bill. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I uh, appreciate the bipartisan work that was done on H.R. 1984, the Disclosing Aid Spent to Ensure Relief, or Disaster Act, an appropriate acronym, I believe. It was introduced by Congressman Peters of California and our subcommittee's ranking member, Congressman Meadows of North Carolina. As you described, this bill would direct the Office of Management and Budget to compile, aggregate, and organize all federal disaster relief assistance information that it currently collects and put it into an annually produced, user-friendly, publicly available report. There were 14 natural disasters last year that each resulted in over a billion dollars loss, and it's been estimated by a report that came out of the Congressional Budget Office last month entitled Expected Cost of Damage from Hurricane Winds and Storm-Related Funding, uh, Flooding, excuse me, that the federal government is facing unprecedented rising costs. It could be as much as $54 billion annually. This Disaster Act will help us have needed information, give us a better understanding of how we're currently spending taxpayer resources, and hopefully lead to better informed debates, policies, and spending decisions that can bend the curse, co cost curve downward. I think it's a good bill, and I encourage the members of this committee to support it, and I yield back. Thank you, 